Hey guys, Stefan here from Weekend Warrior Shop. Today, unboxing EMF 100 from Planet Eclipse 2022. Let's have a look. Yeah, first of all, when you buy a EMF 100 from Planet Eclipse, it will come in this nice box to you. Very so high quality box, as I think. And let's open it. Nice top, put it by side. First, we have a manual, big manual, and with everything you need to know. It, I think in paintball, it's a good manual. It's a very, um, very good manual and it includes all you need to know about your EMF 100. Next one, the paintball gun itself. I think most of you know it. Here the mag well. You can, you have here a dummy mag. This is for when you play with hopper. Then you have to use this one. You can use mags on this gun the CF20 from Planet Eclipse, Die Dam magazines, and the FID mags. That are the three that will work with this mag well, and you will have no problems and can play as much as you want. After that, you have over here, you can um, you can adapt the hopper here. We have an adapter to use hopper also. Over here, we have the pops on off. It's, I think, the same like in Ether 2. Um, the, or like an EMAC, the only difference is that there's no electronic inside. Over here, we have the opportunity to use a PVR stock or you have, um, that we will come later to it, you have the, um, you can use other stocks for your, um, for this gun if you want to. Over here, EMC kit, a normal, the long version. You can short it up for CQB setup. The barrel, you have barrel, barrel thread as cocker, uh, matrix cocker thread, and you have a two piece barrel. It's a shaft barrel. Left sided, you have to thrill it. Back and the front, you can also switch the back to the shaft FR back. Important thing. Over here on this thread, you only can use shaft fronts and the second one, you can put a muzzle on this, but the only muzzle that will work with this thread is the Planet Eclipse Quake muzzle. That will work, no other muzzles, no Hammerhead, M50, no, not the else muzzles you know um, in paintball business or suppressors, maybe 3D, um, printed things, they will work also, but um, as usual use, um, the only thing is the quake muzzle. Put it together back, put this inside. Next one, nice info for the guys who want to play a CQB setup with uh, MacFed. The shortest barrel you can use is 8 inch. When you use the 8 inch hammerhead cocker thread or 8 inch Nemesis Kamatech uh, barrel, you will get like this and then you have the muzzle brake in front. Um, that's also a nice or well, important info, information. It's often that people call us in our shop or wrote an email or a message on Instagram or Facebook or something like this or commented on YouTube. Uh, how long can the barrel be? Can I use a six, six inch? Can I use a eight inch? Can I use, uh, what can I use? Can I put a Widowmaker on it? Widowmaker has four, uh, four, uh, four, five, four point five inches. It's too short for this. You will get something like over here on this point. You will be there with the ending of the barrel. Um, that's not so fine. So um, eight inch is the way to go. Next one, this little box. What's inside here? And that's, as I know, Planet Eclipse, very fine, high quality stuff. 
this box with the things inside. It's very nice. You have here loop degrees um, for, uh, for making your EMF ready to play. It's the same like you get it when you buy an Ether 2, Ether 3, Emac, what else. Um, you put it on a bit of these on the O-rings on the bolt system and it will work fine and I think it's the only maintenance you have to do after a day of gameplay. You put this one, uh, you clean the gun, clean the bolt, after that you degrease on it, uh, on the O-rings and it will work fine. Here we have a bunch of tools. All you need to disassemble your EMF 100. As I told before, the hopper adapter, this one is PAL ready. PAL ready um, means that you can use PAL hoppers with it. I recommend PAL hoppers if you are using hopper play or electronic hoppers. It's very nice with PAL hoppers. We use Emacs with PAL hoppers on our paintball playground for rental use. It's very nice. Over here, screws, O-rings, all you need for your gun to maintenance. One CF20 magazine. I think this is very good that you have one, but for playing Magfed you also need three more minimum. Uh, I think three to six. Uh, it's all about your play style or the playground where you play, but one is not enough for playing Magfed. You got two barrel socks and that's really nice. Um, you have one big one for EMF working with EMC kit and one, the normal one, as everyone knows, for short version over the barrel. And therefore, uh, or there, nice information also, the big one, we are uh, selling single, uh, you can only buy this one in our shop because many MacFed player love these big barrel socks. You can use it with fake suppressors, you can use it with any kind of muzzle. It also works very fine and you have the way that you are very safe. That's very nice. And over here in this box we have the last adapters. I won't open it yet uh, now because it's uh, a new one for our store to sell and I can't open all. And there in here, there are a bunch of little plastic adapters for you to use on the EMF 100. Not only the PVR stock, but you also can use other tubes. It's the Tipman M4 buffer tube, I think. The plastic rod over here where you can put on stocks. Then you have the same stock like basic Tipman TMC, like Tipman Stormer or Kronos and you can put any stock on it, like everything that works in Airsoft, you can put on these uh, Tipman buffer tube. That's also very really nice. I played it a long time um, because I get one of the first EMFs and as I started playing with the EMF, there wasn't the PVR stock available. So I used this Tipman M4 buffer tube with the adapters and an another stock and played it. After um, there was the availability of the PVR stock, I bought a PVR stock because I think it's very nice. And yeah, that's it, what you get with your EMF 100. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you, uh, there was a bit of information you, doesn't, you, you don't know. Or uh, yeah, it helps you. If you have any ideas or wishes for videos, unboxing tutorials, troubleshooting, any gun, anything you want to know, as we do it on our German uh, channel, we all want to hear what you want to see and then we uh, try to make videos for you. So please comment and then I have uh, some impressions what you want, what you need, what's interesting for you and we can make some more videos for that. I hope you enjoyed, have a nice week and goodbye.